Welcome to the second part of our open box arch merged. So quick look. This is what we're on. Not, nobody says anything about new fetch and that's why it doesn't pop up here. So if you want rather have it straight away, you go to your bash RC. And next time will be just fine. Just add new fetch the last bit. And done. We'll see results shortly well that's that so we've installed um we first downloaded well first downloaded the is iso arch merged then we got with this thing here with git clone we installed everything really everything till here from there till there but we haven't installed the personal yet so i'm going to install that as well and then move on to the design in another tutorial because you see these borders are not looking nice and that's because we still have to set them. So that's going to be designing and theming and tweaking. That's an other tutorial. Now I'm going to run these personal scripts and the personal scripts will be shown here. This one actually just creates directories if they're not. But this one is an important one for me. It will pop up here all the things, the places I need to be on my system. You probably need to be there as well. But of course, if you don't have i3 and all that, then it's not needed. If you don't have in sync, then it's not needed, etc. But most of the things you'll need anyway. Icons, icons, themes, themes, conkeys are there. All the applications are here. The variety who downloaded the wallpapers, this wallpaper is in here in downloaded. So you probably need them anyway. But just see what uh, you can use. So, ls <coughs> Firefox. You should run Firefox first. Then you make some little folder, little account on the config. And then, then only then, can we run number 200 as it will write some small CSS coding to say that if there is a dark theme, that we should make the input boxes white as background and the font black so we can read what we type otherwise it will be grayish and not so good to see the 900 is installed the long-term uh, uh, support for the kernel i'm not going to do that one uh, i'm on a virtual box anyway so um, i've tried it several times so that's fine if you want to go back to 3.9 something that's good. Uh, otherwise, you just keep the kernel that we have now. And the kernel, you can read it in NeoFetch here, is 4.13. So you can always do pseudo pacman and check out minus s kernel something. Uh, kernel. Oh, sorry. I think I, I'm telling you stupidities. So if we go back to our place to be which is actually here on Eric control H AMDB personal these things here what do they get let's have a look scroll up it's gonna get the, of course Eric it's a name L Linux dash LTS and Linux not kernel and um, that's what it's gonna install either the Linux kernel or the Linux dash or is it stroke LTS uh, so that's uh, what's done here, but we will not do it. All right, um, that concludes this tutorial, I guess.